Okay, so go ahead and go into the Google Play Store. Then go ahead and type in APS3. Go ahead and hit install. Once it installs, go ahead and go into your Google Chrome browser. Now, once you're in the website, go ahead and scroll down to where it says how to update PS3 system software. Go ahead and hit update using a computer. And once it's downloaded, go ahead and go all the way back. Downloads. Okay, now go into your file explorer and go to where it says downloads. Then go ahead and click and hold that and move that into your folder where you're hosting your PS3 games. Go ahead and hit move here. Hit finish. And then go ahead and go back and go ahead and click on the game that you're willing to, that you're trying to run. And now it's going to say compiling PPL modules. This one's going to take a while, so I'm going to go ahead and fast forward the video. Now, once that's done, it's going to go ahead and say installing game data. Then it's going to be compiling shaders in, in the bottom left corner. Then after that, the game should be booting right up. Okay, so that's it for this video. Um, this video was just to show you how to install the APS3 emulator. And it was also to show you that to install the PS3 update firmware file, you don't need a computer. I've seen a couple of videos where it shows that you have to connect it to a computer. You have to download it and then uh, drop it into your phone. But you clearly don't have to do that. You can just do this just using your phone. Uh, when you're on the website, click and hold it open up in a new tab and then the download will start automatically. Uh, I'm going to be making some more videos, um, tweaking some more settings and testing some new gameplay uh, from other games. So if you guys are interested in that, go ahead and leave a like, comment and subscribe. And the next time I drop a video, you guys will be the first to know. So that's pretty much it for this video.